all right y'all here we go we're gonna do a little live hunt around this little splash pad and there's a volleyball court over there we might hit last time i was at the splash pad i found a random wheat penny which was pretty cool there's going to be a lot of trash in this area so So we're going to have to be somewhat uh, selective in our targets. Because <laughs> I don't have time to dig every piece of foil. I mean, if y'all like foil, I'll do a... I'll do a video where I just dig full if that's what y'all want. <laughs> okay, I got a solid 25 right there. Very well could be a nickel. Or a pull tab. Let's find out. At least it's a small target, so it should be one or the other. What is that? Well, it's just a big piece of foil. <laughs> That's okay. That was a good jewelry number. We had to dig that one, baby. I could not pass by that solid 25 and not dig it. So I ain't mad at that. Well, yeah, that's probably a penny. Let's get the hunt going with the coin at least. Well, maybe she's a little deeper than what I thought. She ain't two and a half inches deep. I think it's over here let's get a little plug going I didn't mean to break it because I wanted to make it a little bigger than that but oh well I guess it is what it is now uh, there's some interesting signals going on down there There she blows. I seen to her. It is a coin we got on the board, baby. <laughs> now, even though I found a weedy here once before, I'm really looking for jewelry. Because if you're playing with your kids on the splash pad, you're getting cold and wet and hot and this is some, like a place where you'd lose jewelry even though i'm going straight to the place where i found the wheat penny i got a 20 24 25 there it just sounds delicious it just sounds like if there's a gold ring in this park that would be the number But it is not. It is what we all thought it would probably be a squashed pull tab. <laughs> what do you call a dream squasher when it's squashed? 
<laughs> oh well. We you gotta go for those numbers if you want gold rings, I'm telling you. Oh, I don't know if I told uh, if all y'all know yet, but um if you watched my live If you watched my live video the day I was trying out the new beast mode, uh, that cross I found ended up being 10K and the diamonds are real. That's the first gold I found in quite a while, y'all. It's funny, I, I, I hit a spell there where I found a couple pieces of gold and I thought that was going to be normal. And then, and then I went through a long, a long time without finding any gold. And I just didn't know what I, uh oh. Didn't know what I was doing wrong, man. I was digging all the signals. It should have been gold. And I just wasn't finding it. There's another penny. Another coin, baby. And I started thinking I would never find gold again. And when I found that cross, I had found one that looked just like it almost. Probably, I don't know, about two three weeks before. And it was junk and it had a little rust on it. So when I saw it, it looked just like the other cross. And I was like, oh, I found another one of those junk crosses. And I didn't even think about it. Didn't even think about it. And... took it home and I was looking at it I was like man that looks awful lot like gold now that I oh shoot hey we got us a nickel got us a nickler tickler on the board one of the newer ones but hey I got a penny and a nickel need a dime and a quarter I hit the cycle and it was funny because I was just looking at it at home I had it in my I threw my jewelry in my hand. I went, went inside. I left the rest of my stuff out in the man cave. And I was looking at that cross. And I was like, man, that looks an awful lot like gold. But my gold tester was out in the, out in the man cave. Well, I got to thinking. I was like, well, you know, if it's real... Those diamonds are probably real. Cause there's little diamond chips, you know. That sounds like junk, but we're gonna go for it. So I decided to test the diamonds. It's got 19. It's got 19 little diamonds on it. And as I tested them, they all came up real. And I was like, what the hell? Pool tab is Maximus. So I was like, well, this must be real gold. So I put it, scratched it on the stone, put the 10K on there, and that sucker stayed. It just stayed, stayed. I was like, nice. And I put the 14K on there, and it stayed. And I was like, ooh. But then after about 20 seconds, 25 seconds, It went away. So I'm guessing it's either 10K or a very. Another 25. I'm guessing it's either 10K or a very weak 14K, but either way, either way, I got some gold on the board, baby. What is that? Oh, it's another pull tap. <laughs> been a while since your boy had found some golden diamonds so I was happy 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 uh oh that 
that's a high ringer right there. It was like 48 to 50 something. I think it's right there. Probably either a dime or a quarter, but it'd be nice for a big old silver ring, wouldn't it? There she goes. It is a beautiful dimer. I'm just missing the quarter. That was it. I'm missing the quota and we'll have to cycle. I used to have a little joke, I called it the park board, where I wanted to find at least one of each coin and a piece of uh, jewelry, whether it's junk or not, and I considered that was completing the park board. Well, that's my 50, 50, 49 right there. So that should be my quarter right there. And there she blows. It is a very orange state's quarter, but I will take it, baby. That's what we do. We hit the cycle. Now can we just fill the park board and get us a piece of jewelry? That would be nice. I hit the tot lot already. It was kind of lackluster. I'm not sure if y'all see that or not. Would y'all dig that? Would you dig it? Because I was debating about it. But I did find that gold cross that was a solid 11 the other day. So that sounds horrible. Should be right around yonder. One more scoop. Oh, there she blows. I seen it. Where'd it go? There was a nail. I seen it. I wanted to get it. Oh, I see it. I don't want to be digging that 11 again. Just a regular old nail. Not a square nail or anything. Nothing special. But hey, we're doing okay. We're finding coins. We're having fun. It's a beautiful day. It's probably going to rain on us in any minute here and drown my wireless microphone. <laughs> but that's just the way things go, man. Right here is where I found that little wheat penny last time I was here. Got a 27 there. I'm like a thousand percent sure it's a pull tab. But it could be a gold ring, so we gotta try. Yep, there she blows. Pull Tabus Maximus, our arch enemy. Okay, 
we've already hit around the front. Let's let's go around the side. We're at 15 minutes. If I hurry, we might be able to hit the we might be able to hit the uh, what you call it the volleyball court too. Uh. Okay, let's go down the side here. I know that was a 16. That's probably the gold ring I'm looking for. Nah. That's... I thought about it. Solid 26. Right there between the pull tab and a nickel. But it could be what we're looking for. But I see it already. And it's the pull tabus maximus. And I got a mosquito bite my neck. Ah! What the that in the old pockeroonie? Yes, I got my golf ball in there still. <laughs> I dumped all the trash and lit the golf ball today. Someone asked me if it was my lucky golf ball. And you know what? Since then, I kind of... Ugh. It just bounced too much, man. I wanted it. I really wanted to go for that one. It was a 26 at first, but then it bounced to 20. 47, 46, probably a dime. Could be a quarter. This depends on how it's sitting in the ground, I guess. Uh, could be a silver ring. Could be whatever that is. No! It's one of those screw-on things. Yuck. We'll throw it in the old pockeroonie, though. I know that's what it was, because those always give off a good signal. I've got a collection of those. I should sell them. Hey, if you want one, let me know. I'll uh, list it on eBay. <laughs> oh. now I remember a couple years ago I was hunting in this area and I found an old easter egg that it had fallen apart And what was cool about it was the Easter egg. The Easter egg had a bunch of older pennies in it. So it made me wonder. It was about six inches deep. And most of the pennies were from like the 80s. Some were from the 70s. And one was a wheat penny. That made me awful happy. And Easter just passed, so this would be a good place to hide eggs. Uh oh, y'all, this doesn't sound like it's gonna be good. I'm 
thinking this is going to be some kind of irrigation or something for this thing here because it did not sound like it was this deep. It makes me think it's going to be big. Yeah, we're going to leave that alone, y'all. Yeah, I know. It could be a wheat scent or a silver dime or something good, actually. Oh, it's just a shell. But more than likely, it's a copper pipe for this water park I'm right next to. So I'm going to leave it alone. Sometimes you just have to know when to say when. And I'm saying when. See, I'm in the land of foil and trash right now, so let's go over, see, we're at 21, almost 22 minutes. Yeah, let's see if we can hit this uh, volleyball court a little bit first. Yeah, there's too much junk. And I got my sensitivity set down like I was hitting the top, like I was hitting this hot lot. When I drove by, I looked at all the footmarks in this uh, volleyball court. And I was like, dang, those like people have been playing. But I'm going to tell you right now, I'll bet y'all a dollar I'm going to find a screw in, <laughs> in this. Uh, Volleyball court somewhere. Because I always seem to find a bunch of like drywall screws. That's probably it right there. Let's go ahead and dig it so we can get it over with so I don't owe y'all a dollar. Well, it's a beer cap. Almost as bad. Whatever it is, it's right there. There she is, y'all. The screw I promised y'all. Do not owe y'all a dollar. <laughs> I would have paid. Uh, let's see, I got... That was only half the screws. So the head's in there somewhere, but let's rock. I would have paid. I only have, what was it? A little under 2,088 subscribers, so it wouldn't have broke me. Would have been unfortunate. Because <laughs> I'm a poor Texan, that would have been a lot, of, a lot of gas money for hunts. Oh no. That's a holdover from hurting having the hurt back. I thought I ducked enough for the. I thought I had ducked enough for, to get under the net, and I had not. Huh. That's probably that right there. Yep. Piece of wire. Those weird pieces of wire, you know, that your detector just don't know how exactly to react to them. Because, like, it's iron here, it's rusted, over here it's still galvanized, it's a high tone. 
so it is what it is that's so deep it doesn't even show up on the on the meter well y'all this volleyball court is looking pretty pretty dull pretty dull I think people hit these a lot let's something down there probably another screw Uh-oh, that is not a screw. That is a diamond earring. It is so fake, it is rusted all over. But that's some blingity bling. Every time I come around your park, bling bling. Nothing but earrings and rings bling. I'm gonna find it, bling bling bling. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, I know it's junkity junk, but I love finding the, the jewelry. So that, that gives me hope. That is re-energize your boy, the Texan detector. Even though it's junkity junk, it is a piece of jewelry. Now I got another signal just like it right there. Could it be the other earring? Let's see if I can. Well. Okay. Oh, I seen it. It is another one. Oh, that's not a screw. What is that? Some kind of clip off of something. Nothing major. Why did I put it in the found spots? Well, I guess if I do a wrap up this week, you'll see it. <laughs> okay. Where are we at? 28 minutes. Well, we found every coin and we found a piece of jewelry. We filled the park board. I am not going to stress any more than that. That's, that's what I head out to do when I hit a park. And this is just the first park. I'm probably going to hit a couple more. And there I go, not ducking far enough and knocking my headphones off. <laughs> I just don't, well, I was going to say, I don't feel these, what is that? It's a star. There we go. We ducked under that one. Sounds like junkity junk. Is that it? I don't know. Are you kidding me? 
it is just a piece y'all see that a piece of a screw why not put it in the fine pouch <laughs> i'm not looking to find pieces of rusty screws i'm looking for rusty spoons <laughs> i wonder if anybody uh, who watches my channel knows who salad fingers is i doubt it i think i'm one of the few people that crazy Okay, we at 30 minutes. Let's hunt around this little gazebo and call this a hunt. Ugh, it's a... 45 says it's two inches deep. Sounds way bigger than a dime. And it feels like it's a lot deeper. But we're going to do it anyway. Should have got it right there. Oh, what is that? That's it. A piece of... I don't know. Dang it, I missed the trash. <laughs> There we go. We leave the park better than it was when we got there. So we're going to stop what we're doing because I'm about to ruin uh, and throw this in the freaking trash can. Stop what you're doing because I'm about to ruin the image and the style that you used to. Ugh. I want to go for that 11 so bad, but it was just so much iron thump there. I couldn't do it. I just couldn't do it, y'all. I remember one day I was detecting here, and I got by this little uh, light pole, and I found like a heck of a coin spill. I think it was like $2.47. for it and it's a pull tab just like I thought we're at 33 minutes well y'all I guess I'm gonna go for one more good signal if y'all want to hang along that hang around that long and hopefully we find something cool I think there's like a quarter or a dime or something in between these two. Man, I'm seeing pull tabs and bottle caps all over the place, so. Not looking good for you, boy. Twenty-five, twenty-four. We're almost one hundred percent sure it's a pull tab, right? Did I miss it? Totally. There it is. Stupid pull tab. We can't end on a pull tab, can we? Or do y'all like pull tabs? <laughs> Not me. 
They're my mortal enemy, even though I dig them all the time. Come on, one more good target. Too much iron thump in that one. The next good target, y'all. Now, better hurry up because I'm at 15% battery. <laughs> what the heck is that? What is that? It's like an old sock torn up. I guess somebody had no toilet paper. <laughs> Been there, done that. We'll just start walking back towards the truck. We're, la we're bound to stumble across something good. Uh, sounds like sounds like a coin, but it also sounds like a bottle cap. Because there's a thump in there. And it also feels like there's something hard <laughs> underneath here. So uh, yeah, this is gonna be junk. Well, it'd be like that sometimes. It be like that sometimes. There's something right there. Well, there she goes, y'all. I hate to do it, but we're at 37 minutes, so I'm going to end it on this little screw top. What is it, anyway? Just a white screw top. Well, y'all, I found, a, I found uh, an earring and one of every coin. What more can you ask for in 37 minutes at a local park that you hit, like, once a month? <laughs> All right, y'all. Until the next one, happy hunting and stay dirty, my friends.